Hey everyone, we're here today to do another video to show the new Stern Star Wars Pinball Code 1.0. So we're going to do a little bit of gameplay on it and also how to download the code from the Stern website to your machine and how to open it and install it onto your machine. So let's start by going to the Stern website, which I'm kind of already at, but let's start from the beginning. So it's Stern Pinball dot com so now we're at the page of stern pinball their home page so what you want to do is you want to go to support and then go to game code and then right here is all the game codes for the three different versions of the uh, the star wars game so we have the premium i'm going to click on the premium that's as a choice you have game code up on top here, the readme file on the bottom that shows all the new updates to the code. So if we click on that, this shows all the new updates to 1.0. And there's a lot. They actually fixed a lot, which is great. Uh, I already installed this before. I played a little bit of it. So yeah, there are some new sound call outs and some new effects and stuff like that. So it's pretty good so far. So I'm going to uh, click out of that window. Then I'm going to I have a folder on my desktop here called New Folder 3, which I want to save this game code to. You can just left click it and just download it to your machine somewhere. But I always right click it and put Save Link As and just direct it to my new folder. So go to Desktop, New Folder 3. That's the name of the file Star Wars LE Update, you know, 12122.1.0 SPK. Hit Save. So if you look at the bottom here, it says, I think, about 20 minutes to go. It should speed up. Uh, maybe the web's a little slow right now. But it's going to download to this folder here, new folder 3, where it's going now. So let this file download, and then we're going to show how to put it on a memory stick and then put it to your pinball machine. Okay, so here we are. We downloaded the code to this new folder three as I showed in the earlier video. So let's just minimize the window a little bit here, bring it up. So now we have the code which is right here as a zip file. This icon, it's called WinRAR, so that's why it's like in this type of icon. But also I have my computer open, which is on this one, right hand side window here. So this is my memory stick right here, USB 220 FDH. So let me double click that and open that window. So it's a blank memory stick. Um, I'm not sure of the size of this stick. So it's eight gigs, about seven gigs around there. So this file is four gigs, so we should have enough room to put it to this memory stick. So what I do is to open this zip file or whatever kind of file that, that uh, Stern uploads to their website for you to download with their memory on, or with their code on it is I right click on that file and then I put open with which is down here and I put Windows Explorer so I left click on that opens up this other window has three files in it I think the readme file was wrong I didn't even read it I just grabbed all three files just you know, hold your left mouse button highlight all three of those now they're all highlighted hold your left mouse button again after you highlight the three and just copy it over and you see it turns into like this little icon with three on it That means we're copying to your memory stick. This window on the right is my memory stick window Let go of the left button and it's going to copy those files to the memory stick So it's going to take a little time to download. I'm sure four gigs of uh, files to your memory stick sometimes I take these files and copy them to my desktop first then to the memory stick you could do it that way too but um just for this video i'll just show it to do it that way so let's let that copy over once it's copied over i'll go to the pinball machine i'll show how to upload it to the pinball machine okay so before we go to the pinball machine let's wait till this finally finishes copying over so we could kind of see the three files on the memory stick and ready to be installed into the machine to update your code. Uh, as you could see, 
where these files are placed on the memory stick they're not in a folder they're nowhere else like when you do code updates or color dmd updates or anything like that you never want to put it in a folder named something else or just somewhere else on that memory stick you always want to they call, they would call that the parent directory which is the very top directory of, of of a directory on a computer or a file system so on the memory stick as well you could see the three files that we opened up through the zip file that was on the Stern Pinball website all got copied over to the top directory, the parent directory on the memory stick. So it's not hidden in any folder because if you go to put that in your computer and it's in another folder, the computer or the pinball machine, I should say, probably will not recognize those files because it can't find it within another folder. The path directory of the update, I believe, is to the parent directory of the memory stick. That's where it looks first. So uh, let's just wait the 10 seconds here or 20 seconds just to see the three files copied over correctly. And then again, we're going to take the memory stick from the computer that we're downloading it to, bring it to the pinball machine, and show how to install it onto the pinball machine as well. It's, it's pretty easy. It's not really that difficult to do. Uh, but just for the people who don't know, it would be a good help. So the three files are here. Make sure you have all three files copied over. Again, the README on the Stern website, from what I read, said the two files, but it's really three. So that's, that's the three files that you could see. So we're going to take the memory stick out now and bring it over to the pinball machine and copy this new code to the pinball machine. 